A Tuscaloosa man set to stand trial for the murders of two men is now a free man. And that is all thanks to a key piece of evidence. WVTM 13 Chip Scarborough shows us what made that life changing difference. Shadrell Matthews is spending his first full day as a free man tending to his grandmother's yard. The Tuscaloosa man has spent the past four years in jail, accused of being an accomplice in two murders in 2013. Yeah, I had ill will. Anybody would, you know. I was upset. I was mad. Matthews was charged with helping Alexius Foster kill Foster's uncle and friend six years ago. Foster was convicted in 2015, and Matthews was just days away from standing trial himself when a discovery was made. Well, the evidence has been there since day one. A witness was set to testify in the upcoming trial that Matthews had deep stab wounds on his body that were related to the murders, but his attorneys recently uncovered photos they say make it clear he couldn't have been involved in the crimes. They say these photos show Matthews just days after the killings and there are no recent wounds, so the charges were dropped. It's always a special feeling when the system works right, and in this case, the system worked right. So Matthew says it's easy to take for granted the little things like being able to be at home and also being able to cut the grass. Looking up, looking around, going to the bathroom when I want to, going to the refrigerator, you know, getting out whenever I see fit. Things he plans to make count more than ever now that he has a second chance at life. His focus, getting a job and taking things one day at a time. In Tuscaloosa, Chip Scarborough, WVTM 13. Well, happening.